Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. My name is Shaquita and if you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome. On today's video, we will filling in individual lashes. Um, it had been really on me to go ahead and start teaching myself how to do the individual lashes. So if you're interested in seeing how I accomplish individual lash application, then please stay tuned. Okay, you guys, so these are all of the products that I will be using um, to accomplish my individual lash application. And I'll make sure I list all of the products below. So feel free to check out my description box for any helpful links and products listed. So right here, I am just putting the lashes. I like to go under my natural eyelashes. Some people like to go on top. I prefer for individuals to go under only because I like the fact that when I close my eyes it looks as if my eyelashes are really that long I was afraid to do it at first but it's really not that bad you just make sure you they the, the you just make sure I cannot talk that the lashes start right where your natural lashes start that's all and just make sure you fan them to make sure that the glue is nice and dry so next I am just plucking away at any sparse hairs on my eyebrows this is basically the prepping process for before I even do my brows at all to keep my eyebrows looking good sharp and snatched so I tweeze them first brush them upward and then I cut all of my brow hairs equally that way you know I don't have them looking all raggedy because I like a nice crisp brow whenever I fill them in and then once I do that I go in with the eyebrow archer that I got from my local beauty supply store just to clean up that shape a little bit more and then next we're gonna remove any facial hair from the face um, as you can see I get a lot of hair basically towards my chin area and around my mouth so I like to go ahead and clean that up whenever I'm doing like a pampering treatment um, on those days and I have time to kill and you know the kids are down sleep or you know one sleeping one in school you know what I mean um, I just take my time remove any hair and I yes I use the same eyebrow archer to remove those hairs around my mouth and around my jaw bone and just take your time now I will say I didn't think I was pressing hard until I washed my face and my face started to burn so a word of advice don't press so hard if you're gonna use an eyebrow archer don't press so hard sis just gently remove the hair it might take a little longer but at least you don't have to suffer from the burning and as you can see all of that hair that was on my face and around my jaw bone was that that's not cute sis so I took care of that and now I'm just taking care of the hair on my forehead because they tend sparse hairs like to grow all the way to my eyebrow so I'm just removing that also and you guys it just helps your foundation and your makeup go on to your skin like butter and adhere to your skin and the primers more better so that's why i do this next i'm washing my face using the sky organics black soap or african soap and i'll link that also in the description box below and just removing because when you do it with the eyebrow archer you're also taking away that layer that dead layer of skin and then you also want to put moisture back into your skin once you wash. I'm doing that with the Tatcha Dewy Mask. And you want to leave that on your face for 15 minutes. And while I did that, I went ahead and just touched up my nails um, during those 15 minutes. And that's just the soap that I washed my face with. So as you can see, they don't look too bad. Um, I do this at home when I don't have acrylics on my nails or gel or whatever you want to call it and I'm just shaping up my nail right here and then I'm gonna go in with my OPI polish first well 
if you're doing it for the first time I was taught that you're supposed to put the the base the gel base and the top coat first to give the polish something to adhere to and then you put the top coat on, on and then you just go polish top coat polish top coat depending on how thick you want the polish and how shiny you want your nails and this is also a gel lamp that I got from Amazon I'll put the links below for that and I completed that step like twice so you want to do polish top coat and then put it under the UV gel lamp for 120 seconds and then repeat the step again until you know it's shiny and the polish is opaque like you like it so by the time I finished that part it was time to take off my mask my alarm went off I'm just taking that product from out of the bag and putting it on my face just to make sure it's nice and moisturized which it was and then after I put the gel on my nails I'm just shaping my nail back up because sometimes when you add multiple coats of gel it tends to disturb the shape that you're going for so I'm just going back and reinforcing the shape and then I am going to remove any of that kick up from filing the nails and then I'm applying my little oil to my nails making it professional y'all and yeah that pretty much sums up this video and thank you so much for watching Okay, you guys, so that is my basically pampering routine that I give myself for just maintenance. Um, if you already follow me on Instagram, you already know that I did these myself. I did go ahead and redo them and to do them smaller. Again, if you're not following me, go ahead and do so. I'll put it on the screen. It is beauty underscore with underscore quee q u i follow me and I showed you the technique that I used to accomplish these passion twists um, so if you want to know how to do those make sure you watch that video and thump gives it you know press the heart give it a like and make sure you share it I basically did the same technique the only difference is I did them smaller um, when I redid them so that is all for today's video I hope you guys really enjoyed it if so please feel free to give me a thumbs up and comment down below let me know what are some of the things that you do to kind of like keep up the maintenance make you look womanly healthy like you drink all your water and like you just got life figured out since let me know below Comment down below I would love to hear some of the things that you guys do to just really pamper yourself and until then i will see you on the next video bye